In just a couple of hours, Chula Vista Mayor Mary Casilla Salas will deliver her final State of the City address. She's being termed out after eight years in office. CBS 8's Kelly Hesedal talked to the mayor today one on one. She joins us live from Chula Vista with what she learned. Kelly. Yeah, and the mayor will be delivering her speech here at uh, council chambers. Now, I was able to talk to her for about 20 minutes or so today. Uh, we talked about all range of topics, including the future of Chula Vista. Here's some of our conversation. Take a listen. When you look down the road and, and picture Chula Vista 10 years from now, what do you see? I see that the city is going to be growing in influence in the region and that we will become a major player and um, and that we will be the hub and the center for a lot of economic development, a lot of job growth. And she says Chula Vistans have a lot to look forward to, from the billion dollar Bayfront project to the SDSU Chula Vista Cinematic Arts Center. Both projects are scheduled to open in 2025, so just a few years from now. And Mayor Salas says the economic benefits they'll bring will enhance the quality of life in this community. Uh, so she really sees that as her biggest accomplishment, putting Chula Vista on the fiscal path that it is now. Now, Mayor Casillas Salas is the first elected Latina mayor of the city. She's been a part of local and state government for 30 years. She's been on the council. Uh, she also served in the state assembly. Uh, we talked about one of the biggest concerns that we've heard from people in the South Bay, which is the issue of homelessness. She told me the closure of Harborside Park will likely be extended into the new year. Also, the pallet shelter, which she says should have been open by now, remains under construction. If the rents keep on uh, climbing, um, if families are being forced out of their cars and they're uh, out of their homes and they're living in their cars, it may get worse before it gets better. It's going to take, I think, even a federal approach to the homelessness issue. And there will be a lot of new leadership at City Hall, uh, a lot of new faces on the City Council, and it appears uh, Councilmember John McCann will be taking over Mayor Salas's seat uh, as mayor. As for Mayor Salas, uh, her speech begins tonight at 6 o'clock, again here at City Hall, and the public is invited to attend. Back to you. Kelly has it all reporting for us. Thanks, Kelly.